this when it's raining. What is the first thing I do when I get to a hotel room and check in? I will tell you. I <laughs> take my bunny and bunny goes on the bed. <laughs> That's literally the first thing I do. But welcome to Venice. I literally just checked in, got greeted by some gorgeous champagne from Armani. Ate all the berries except one, should eat that one. <laughs> and I have not one, but two packages that arrived. One bag and one little mini bag. Okay, there's no Friday unboxing on my Instagram this week, so this is gonna have to do, which one should I choose first? The red one. Okay. <laughs> okay, in here we have C Passion. This is their C, but the red version, basically a red bottle. Oh my gosh, this fragrance. C is like my favorite favorite. It's one of my top three fragrances ever, as you guys know. Then, ooh, this is so exciting. Okay, then we have the Eyes to Kill. Oh my gosh, this is such a throwback product for me because I used it so many years ago and it was like a heavy metal, like silver packaging. Love this mascara. The Lip Magnet, love these two. I worked on the launch for this like two years ago now. This is a really cool shade, number 500. Then we have some eye quattros. Ooh, that's cool. I think I should do like a black eye for my red carpet. Oh my god, the Eyes to Kill Stella, which I haven't actually tried the Stella versions yet, but they're so, they're like little popped eyeshadow. Oh, they're so bouncy. Wow, oh my god, they're like creamy and bouncy. Bouncy. Oh my gosh, they look amazing. <laughs> look how pretty. Mini hotel room tour before we go outside to explore Venice. Um, I have actually been to Venice before, this time last year, but the hotel we were staying at had like its own separate island. So very excited to be on the mainland this time. But this is our little bathroom product situation. Shower gel and body lotion. I love the little pebbles at the top. And then I actually really like the use of space here, how the bath is kind of like in the bathroom a little bit. That's kind of useful. And this is our bedroom. <laughs> I didn't warn her about that. It's just so sweet and cute. I love it and I love the pink and purple shades. Bunnies on the bed. Not gonna show you my suitcases because they're a huge, huge mess. This is my little, I'll show you in the bed in another mirror over here, but this is my little travel outfit. I had this denim top with really cute sleeves and white jeans. Okay, I need to change and go run around Venice. We are walking around Venice. Our hotel is so well located. So you can, literally everything is like a 10 minute walk. And excuse what I'm wearing. I thought it would be cold, so I put on this like random cardigan. <laughs> but I made it to St. Mark's Square. Wow! It's so beautiful. I've only ever seen it in pictures. Last time we were here, we didn't manage to make it here. But it is stunning. Apparently there's a lot of pigeon feeding that goes on around here. Not really my thing, feeding pigeons. But, <laughs> or chasing them, apparently. <laughs> We've come to Cipriani for dinner, having a nice little healthy meal with everyone. We're ready to start our weekend of red carpets, makeup, and wearing my exclusive Armani shade right now. And there we go. Venice by night. It is so gorgeous. It's actually light raining as well. <laughs> oh, my gosh. oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Look around. Wow. There's all the gondolas from the day. 
I think somewhere here might be our hotel. No, I'm wrong. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> oh no, wait, I'm right. I'm right. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Grazie mille. Okay. No slipping. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> My makeup's gonna go over your I'm so excited to see you! Hey, Alex is like, I'm not jumping up and down. I'm so tired right now. Let me see, let me see. You look so pretty, Alex. Good morning. It is breakfast time. Oh, my voice <clears throat> is broken in excitement <laughs> from just seeing Victoria and Alex. <laughs> had such a lovely breakfast and the sun just came out it's been raining all morning we went to shoot this morning and it was so rainy and disgusting that we ran back inside basically and now we're gonna have a little Vic and I breakfast here with this insane view behind us Yay! Oh no, we just had a fight. For the, those that three seagulls crazy. just went for one of the croissants. <laughs> and now he took it and then he was here and then all the other seagulls took it from him. Oh. A couple hours later, actually not even a full hour. Grazie mille. Thank you. And it's raining. Thank you. But we are going to the Armani Beauty Suite. Yes? Armani Beauty Suite? Yes. Okay, good, just checking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're doing the Armani beauty vending machine right now and you can literally try on I'm trying to film this and do it at the same time. You can try on the lipsticks. There we go Woo! It's getting confused because there are too many people in it. I think but should we do 102 is what I'm wearing now I think so let's try 400 Ah, this is so crazy. Oh, should be ready Oh my gosh, no. No way! It's your chase, yeah? No way! Oh my god, it's like a mini bag! <laughs> Ruin the bag. Hold on, I'm gonna try and get it out this way. Here we go. Ta-da! How cute is that? Jade, I got, which is number 400. Little red. Nice. I'm wearing 102. <laughs> The Armani Beauty Suite, seeing all the gorgeous new things. Like something I'm actually wearing on my eyes today are the Armani Beauty Eyes to Kill Stella, and this is the shade number four. Can you see it on my eyes? I feel like this lighting is really helping my situation. And then over the top of that, I put on this palette number eight, which is Festival. It's so gorgeous. That gold shade there, I have underneath my eyes here. And then so many of my favorite products are here. This is the Rouge Darmani Matte, which is what I'm wearing, shade 102 today. <laughs> and then we also have these palettes. This is the Essence in Foundation. We have my favorite, I'll show you my favorite shade. You've seen me use it so many times. Which is number eight. Power Fabric, Luminous Silk, my one true love. Such a rebel. <laughs> For you. <laughs> I think I need this in my house. You know, just sitting on my bed for the night. That's so cool. This is an owl. I can't wear it. Look at my owl. It's so cool. It's a madhouse in here right now. Came back from the Armani Beauty Suite. So now I'm with the lovely Luca over here. Ciao. Ciao. Hello, <laughs> and Ciao. we're gonna do a little half up, half down situation. I put him under time pressure <laughs> literally before I even opened the door. <laughs> because I still need to do my makeup and eat. So let's see how this goes. levels are high, eyeshadow is not blended, and I am desperately trying to do my entire red carpet look in about 10 minutes. 
So let's see how this goes. <laughs> Not looking so hopeful right now. I am using the new Giorgio Armani Eye Quattro Palette. This is in shade number two. I'm using the golden shade up here again today. I can tell this is gonna be a favorite, favorite palette. I'm gonna use the darker shade here and sweep that in my crease. Sorry if this seems a bit rushed because uh, I am. <laughs> Doing a little bit of my favorite Luminous Silk loose powder to mattify. When I'm on the red carpet, I feel like there's so much shine. There's the lights, there's the flash. I don't normally do too much powder, but if there's a lot of photography going on, then the powder comes out. Okay, finally ready to go down. Got all my makeup on, got my Sarah jewelry earrings on. Feeling zen. So we're gonna do a little challenge just to make this night a bit more interesting than it already is. We're gonna do 10 things you might not know about me, or actually 10 things you don't know about me, but Venice edition while we move around tonight. So let's just wait for these doors to close. <laughs> let's get going. Number one, when I'm nervous, I pick the sides of my thumbs like this. And then sometimes I pick them so much that they bleed. How disgusting is that? Right now, you can see I'm not so nervous. My thumbs are intact, both of them. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, my red carpet look. Starting from my bottom. Let's <laughs> start from the bottom. I have these Charlotte Olympia and shoes. They're so cute, they have little lips on them. This dress, which is one of my favorite dresses, I wore it to a wedding in uh, Sweden recently. And it has a little slit at the front, it has a little party at the back, and I have my mom's clutch. Shout out to my mom. <laughs> and then we have my surgery earrings on, and my lips are the new Rouge Delmani matte. Is the new version of my mouth, not our. You know what I meant. My first pair of heels, thick, thick cream heels with like a huge, um, what is it called? Beaded. They were from Marks and Spencer's. And I still have them. And I love them. I'm ready and waiting. I'm ready and waiting. I'm ready and ready and waiting. I'm ready and waiting. I'm ready and waiting. I'm ready and waiting. Hi guys. <laughs> We're all like kind of calm. There's so many people around though, and you're just kind of like walking through the crowd onto the red carpet. And there's just everyone taking pictures, waiting for celebrities. It's kind of a crazy experience. I took a picture on the back of the boat, got totally soaked, so half of my side of my face actually stayed on pretty well, but it was literally half wet. So if you notice that this bronzer doesn't look that good, then uh, you know why. First one in, oh my goodness. Thank you. Wow. This is stunning. Oh, this is so gorgeous. How romantic. Today 
with Armani. Oh, it's just been so lovely today. The red carpet, the dinner, like everything was so gorgeous. Had the best time at dinner. We stayed till one in the morning, which is way past my bedtime. And I didn't even realize because we were just having such a good time. So I'm hunching over because you're all cropped in there. So I thought while I take off my makeup, ooh, 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 <laughs> and look a bit like a panda, <laughs> I would tell you fact number four. This is four or five. I think it's four. <laughs> well, I used to know all the Armani makeup artists and Harvey Nichols by name. And there was one that I always got to do my makeup called Ahmed. I'll put in a picture of me with my makeup on here. He did a whole face of Armani and I still use the products today that he used on me then, which might have been like 10 years ago. In that picture, I can tell you what I'm still wearing. I'm definitely wearing Icicle Mascara and I'm definitely wearing Luminous Silk Foundation. Hello. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. Morning guys. We are on our way on a little gondola. Starting off the day pretty well. <laughs> so cute! Going around to see a little bit of Venice. That's how you see Venice. <laughs> okay, fact number five or six, I think it's five, <laughs> is going to be about my first kiss. This is actually really awkward and it was in Spin the Bottle <laughs> at a friend's house and we went <laughs> to another room and it was just a huge awkward experience and I never saw the guy again although I do know that he came out a couple of years ago so hopefully it wasn't from my kiss <laughs> Boat next door. Just recognize Kat and I. Because we were here a year ago. Pictures, a year ago. Hello. He's like, you take a lot of pictures. I'm like, yes, yes, we do. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, salmon salad. We've come to this gorgeous little restaurant for our last lunch. And I'm sitting in between my bays. Bay number one, bay number two. You like me more though, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yes, I love you both equally. <laughs> I can't, I can't say. You can both think it's you, you know? Both think it's yourself. <laughs> we ordered a little salmon salad and uh, my fries, which haven't arrived. Uh, fries here, yes. <laughs> which one? Uh, this one, please. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Um, Anyone's welcome to have some fries because there's so many of them. So when my first friend of all my friends got a car, we were like 17, he came to pick me up and I was so excited and we got out of the car and I closed the car door. We slammed my finger in the car. Oh, by the way, this is fact number six. <laughs> I slammed my finger in the car as he locked the door so my finger was stuck in the car as the door was locked. You can still see the line, like across here. My finger bled everywhere, all down me. And I didn't want to get back in his new car and get it full of my blood. He <laughs> dropped me home. So I walked up and I was like, it was just around the corner anyway. But I was refused to get in his car with my bloody finger. So I was like holding this like cup of blood in my hand, walking home. And then my nail fell off. It went blue and it fell off. It's a kind of like a funny shape now, and I still have the scar here. It's almost been 10 years. Just had lunch. We're all in a bit of a food coma slash early morning shoot coma <laughs> that's just kicked in. I was like so hyper this morning, and now I'm like not that hyper anymore. At least my energy was like saved for shooting. But we just had such a lovely, lovely lunch. Always me with my sides of fries. Oh, I should show you my outfit today, shouldn't I? Here are my sunglasses, which are new. I got them right before this trip. They literally were the day before. 
my shell necklace, which I have seen is now easily accessible. Like they have them on net -Porte. And this dress, which I literally bought also right before this trip, but I thought it would actually be a really nice autumn transitional kind of dress because it's more like muted yellow tones. My shoes, which I cannot stop wearing. I said I would let you know how comfortable they are. So comfortable, more people all around Venice in them. And my little shell. Which way do we go? I still don't know my way. We've done this walk like 80 times. Anyway, I think it's time that we're gonna head to the airport in a little bit, which is really sad. I just announced on my stories my exclusive Armani lipstick and put up my picture today. And I know there are only a few to sell like they're like a limited stock basically so i'm excited to see everyone wearing it because i've been wearing it this whole weekend it's like the brownie nude you keep seeing me wear but i haven't mentioned it so much in my vlog i don't think because i feel like by the time this is up no one will be able to get it but the shade 102 from the rouge damani mattes is actually really similar uh, maybe slightly pinkier i think fact number seven is that when i was younger my dad I think he was desperate for a boy <laughs> on the girl. And so he would, would take one of those balls, put it around my head, and I had a proper boy haircut. Like, I'm genuinely not like a boy. And my mom says she had to put like pink bows on me, and everyone was very confused as like why there were pink bows on a boy. But I had like a proper ball situation. Like, he'd never cut anyone's hair before, so it just looked like a total like mishapped mess. 26 kilos, not bad for a weekend. Just one. Thank you. Bye. Bye. The perfect time to tell you fact number eight. I have never owned any kind of like online game, computer game thing. Game Boy, PlayStation, what are the other ones called? Wii. Um, Alex is looking at me Xbox. like, what? Xbox. Any other girly ones? What were the girly ones? Girly game consoles. Yeah. I don't know, basically I've never owned any of them. There was like that pink one everyone was obsessed with. Game Boy? I was just never allowed one. So, I've never gone into them. So, <laughs> maybe I was missing out. I don't know. <laughs> Finally getting ready to board the plane. We're bit gate 31, yeah. And I have done my I think second change of the day. I'm wearing this little outfit. Well, I had white jeans with me from the way here and I didn't want to get cold on the plane and then get a cold when I got to London. Such a little moan now, aren't I? <laughs> but, you know, if I had them anyway, then it's fine, right? I'm still wearing my Armani lipstick. It lasts so long. I just had so many snacks while we were sitting down working. Edited uh, my vlog for tomorrow which is, a, you, would, you would have seen that on Monday actually. While I'm waiting for the queue to die down, I just thought of a thing you didn't know about me, number nine, which is what we were just talking about with everyone. We were talking about 23andMe and the genetics test and just family trees and stuff. Basically, I know a lot of people find this weird, so I'm kind of like a bit hesitant to say. Um, but whatever. My grandparents were actually set up, they had an arranged marriage, and they were actually first cousins. <laughs> so my grandparents were first cousins. I just said that. <laughs> I actually never found that weird because I guess I just grew up and they were my grandparents, but whenever I tell people, like their faces are like shocked. So <laughs> I actually kind of find it quite entertaining now. And when I just told everyone when we were just sitting down, everyone was like, <laughs> Which is kind of funny. I'm sure people from similar cultures will relate to other people will find this the strangest thing ever. We saw those arm muscles before, so we know. Yeah. <laughs> With this monkey. Look at his little tail. Oh, bye then. <laughs> Hair is washed. Makeup is off. And I am officially about to get into bed with my, he keeps running away from me. <laughs> anyway, I had the best, best, best time in Venice with Armani Beauty. That was beyond. I got home and I was like, was that all a huge dream? It was just so, so gorgeous. Thank you to anyone that bought a lipstick. I hope you love it as much as I do. The Rouge Armani Matte Formula is beyond. Um, I'll leave all the details for everything down below and I will see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye guys.